Alrighty, so we got our side markers from NHK USA. I'll link their uh, website in the description. So we have two smoked sequential side markers. So we're going to go through the process of uh, putting those on. All right, so just a quick video today. So we have side marker indicators coming in. I already have side markers on my ears, but we're going to get rid of these silly little chrome pieces for a smoked sequential side marker. It's coming later today, so I'm just getting it prepped first. Um, so the first thing was removing these so they have some sticky foam on them. Um, so I just slowly worked under them with my fingernail and then they slide towards the back releasing this clip and then this can clear the fender. Uh, it gives you access to the wiring for the side marker that's already in there. And it's here. It's kind of hard to fiddle out because it's not attached to these like other models of Outlander Sports. There's actually a little tiny thing in there. I'll try to show it that it is attached to. Um, so I had to use a very thin screwdriver so I could... So here's a photo of what the clip looked like before being removed and we'll cut to a video of the clip removal. So I wasn't able to get this with my GoPro so I'm just using my phone just to show you a little bit of what was going on. So this is where the the uh, the harness or the plug for the side indicator was so I had to reach down here with a screwdriver and push down the clip and then pull out the wire at the same exact time so there's a little excess glue from the foam backings for the chrome markers so we're just gonna use some isopropyl rubbing alcohol and clean some of that up so in these fast forwarded clips, you can see the removal of the chrome trim piece, fishing out the wiring clip and the removal of the adhesive backing. All right, this is just a quick example of how easy it's supposed to go. So you just push it back, release the notch right there. I'm gonna fish for the wire. Plug that bad boy in, and we're going to push the clip, and, oh, wow, this one's giving me a hard time now, too. There we go, and we got it. All right, so there we go, we have the, the finished product, sequential smoke turn signals on both sides. Very, very easy, nice, nice upgrade. Thanks for taking the time to watch my videos. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.